Hey guys, in this video, I'll show you how to connect a PS3 controller to your PC running the brand new Windows 11 in 2022. So now let's jump into the video. For this tutorial, there's a few things you need. So first, your controller, then the cable that came with the controller, and then your computer. So you can use PC or laptop, it doesn't matter. So just copy the link right here, and open up the Chrome, and click on Paste. So this is the thing you need. And now click on Download. If there's any ad, just ignore it, and click on Save. And now it's just going to close all the other stuff. Now you just can open it up. So just go to your download, right click on it, right, and click on show more option, and click on extract tool. With this, it will just create a file. And now you can just a, a, a delete the zip, just like that. And now you're gonna click on it, and click one more time, and then you're gonna click on the bin, and now you're gonna click on the SPC driver. But before you do that, make sure you connect your controller to your PC using the cable. Now you're gonna hear the sound, and you're gonna see your controller a flashing, just like that. So now you're gonna just tap on the uh, driver and click on yes. And now you're gonna see you're gonna see something like this. You can uncheck that. And now, and now you're gonna see there's a, a few options in the bottom. So the option, this a Bluetooth driver, that is the thing we don't need. That is only for a, a, if you're connecting via wireless. So now I'll show you how to do that. So if you if you're connecting via a Bluetooth using a PS3 controller, you can actually do that using a USB dongle. So I actually don't have a dongle right now. But things if you have a, like a USB dongle from a, like old keyboard and mouse, you can use that as a, a receiver. So if you have that, you can just grab it and then make sure you check this. But things if you're just connecting like me, it's just using the cable, you can uncheck that. And configure service, you can uncheck that and click on force install this box and see if you install again and see if this time work. Boom, it worked immediately. Now just a, a, a minimize this and now if you just hold the position button, it what up the game menu. As you can see, the controller is working. So as you can see, the controller works absolutely fine. There's no problem or anything. So if you guys enjoyed this video, then make sure you drop a like and subscribe if you need to my channel. See you guys in the next video, then peace out.